since my final levels are picking up a little bit, I notice that I'm very used to having tool belt, where you don't need to bring a rake or sea dibber, spade, and so on. I just forget, and I had one set, so I'm gonna buy a hundred of them. So I never forget. <laughs> if I don't have them in my inventory, I can just claim them. The problem is, after I do a farm run, I usually teleport out, and I forget to deposit everything back to the tool leprechaun. Yeah, I think that looks good. Hundred of each. Don't need sectors and stuff. Now instead of super compost, I can make it into ultra compost. In old school, it's way easier to just mine some volcanic ash, and that's it. And I have the place unlocked already. Yeah, I need to do something about these seeds. These are very, very bought out from Dana Village. I just maybe I need to pickpocket myself. I'm, I guess that's like the only way to do it. But the fail rate is going to be massive at only level 38 thieving. Maybe there's like another shop or something. But no matter how many ho worlds a hub. It's just like a couple of them and it just buy out and you need 40 to do a single birdhouse run and it's super good for those early total levels like i went from level 9 to 30 right now i think it was in one single day or a couple days i forgot at this point so family crest is completed but apparently the cooking gauntlets do not affect the kind of one cooking rate i think so i didn't even check but something like that i'll still wear them just because why not wait hold up i want to show my chest Addy gloves are available, and there would be room if I did that one more step. That's a level, but that's only 69, and I need 69,000 experience until next one. Whoa, what a coincidence. So I don't have any more pretty much left. I'll have to fish more, so I'm not sure if I'm going to finish this step right now, but this also means that there's a lot of kind of ones. I'm going to put maybe 900 for everybody. Actually, how about we take that 60 as well, go to the group storage, and deposit these beautiful... Bam, a thousand for just just for my teammates. And since I started farming recently, I think it's a good idea to go ahead and mine some volcanic ash. However, without level 52 mining, I believe, you only get two ash instead of three. So yes, I'm losing 33% of ash. However, I don't want to level up mining right now. And I just want, it's actually very quick, holy, is it like always like this? Actually, I don't know what, you need two volcanic ash per compost, so that's like 10 ultra compost. Man, compared to RuneScape 3, how difficult it is to obtain ultra compost, you need like 90 something, like 96 farming, and you need dragons and so on. I think 500 is going to be enough for now. I'm gonna put like 120 giant seaweed just in case people need crafting levels because if they have to buy from charter ships it's kind of pain. So I'm doing in search of miracle quests. I just killed a hellhound and I just completed a easy comet task. A demon's best friend. I don't know what that is. So something with maybe it's classified as a demon. It was a skeletal hellhound. Whatever it was. I used water spells as well. <laughs> Alright, gimme gimme. Ultra compost very first time seaweed come on look at this not depleting at all and it's very good farming experience like early game it's it does it still give me a percentage every time i do this yeah still 73 even more so it's above one percent per pick double yep 78 80 god damn it look oh my god it's still going 17 at this farming level 29 only i need 10 more seaweeds to get a level it's still going I, I can't believe how good this is. I should have done this way earlier. I didn't know that the volcanic ash was such low level mining. New item as spotty seed. I literally thought I got a pet. No, not even joking. I, 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 that's what I thought just happened. Stupid as spotty seed, man. Yeah, this one is way less though. Unless this is gonna... No, it didn't last. What the hell? Dude, this is seven. <laughs> so I'm gonna do in eight of miracle quests right now. I need a mithril bar. I'm gonna go to wilderness. I got muddy keys from crazy archaeologists. Only two, but I can just go unlock it. And if someone else needs it, I'll put it in the storage as well. Dude, what do you get? This is like such an old free-to-play battle, like 2005. You just go here to unlock these. Maybe you can make profit now. I don't even know. I swear to God, in aid of Miraku is such a long quest. It feels like I've been doing this for an hour and a half or something, but it's finally completed. I see. We have no law runes in the group storage. I believe people are running out a little bit. So I'm gonna do the deed. I'm gonna buy a thousand. I've got these three ecumenical keys because I'm running out myself. I've got only 23. Just high alcohol, 184k. Gonna do another three keys. Before I go back to ecumenical keys, I decided to chop full inventory of teaks because recently I unlocked the teak birdhouse, but I kept using willows, but I was like, 
problem losing a lot of XP on that, so I got all the way to 37, even though I could have done it like 3 levels ago. Also, yesterday caught 2,000 caramons, so I'm gonna deposit 1,500 because I do need uh, one cooking level myself, and I could get myself some nice... I think it's room gloves at this point, or is it Addy? Literally, just now he said, could someone leave a few caramons in the group storage? I might burn my caramon from Taibu Vanai. <laughs> I'm like, here you go, 1,500. Another successful trip. This time I forget Avas. So it's kind of timed. I got only 143 balls left. Dude, it's so crazy. I got almost 400k cash stack in like 45 minutes. This was the luckiest trips so far. Okay, what about law runes? Are they bought out? Not really. So I'm probably gonna buy well, how much? 260? And this becomes... Ooh, I may not be able to buy 1k unless I do another economic kill key trip. I just don't feel like I'm gonna get lucky again. I don't want to spend one hour hopping worlds. Uh... I'll just do 800 law runes. Yeah, that will do. Maybe put it somewhere at the top like this. Save it. Boom. See, I'm giving back to the team now. And I'm gonna give even more back. Let me do another ecumenical key trip. Damn, look at this play time. Eight days and one hour. Today is... Oh, it's 18th of October? Wait, it's been 12 days already? God damn. Okay, it's not that impressive. <laughs> I thought it was like 10 days or something. I thought I was barely sleeping. Wait, if I'm going battles, do I have to do another ecumenical key trip? I just did the third one right now. I realize it's not only death runes that I need, but also full rune. Because I'm not going to be using prayer potions on like Torag or something. I'm going to assume, yes, that it is in stock. 84,000 just for a play buddy. I just have to do it. 100k left. Can I even buy legs and full helm for this price? I have to go back to ecumenical keys again. Bro, on the tracker I chose 800 imps that I killed now. And I reset like 500 before. Wait, no, I need a Zerker helmet, not a Runeful helmet. So I literally cannot do this. I'm just gonna buy play legs. Wait, can you? I don't think you can buy from here, can you? 64,000. Boom. No cash left again. Jesus Christ, man. It's so expensive, everything that I do right now. Last trip to Ecumenical Keys. Gonna happen right now. I'm not going anymore. That's a, These are the last keys. I, I, I've spent like five hours today at imps. <laughs> Hopping worlds, that's the worst part, you know. Killing M's is like, oh, okay. Hopping worlds, nah, bruh. Not doing this anymore. Now, we're gonna try to do some battles. I just did some last man standing, and I can buy these Dragonstone Bolts E. This is very good for Aaron, because I do have a rune crossbow, and I can use rune bolts. Even if they don't proc, it doesn't matter. They're just real good bolts to use. And you don't kill Aaron that often, right? It's just one guy that you kill, and then a bunch of others you mage, and you don't need that many bolts. It's really not worth buying these, it seems, because you could just buy, like, blighted super restores. Like, I could buy, like, uh, 70 or something. We could do some worldy PBM right now for this you know so it's really not worth but it actually is worth buying i'm just gonna spend every single point that i have for 120 dang it some bolts beautiful now if you watch my previous videos i ran out of charges almost completely i had 15 left before i got to the last two rune crossbows so i'm gonna go ahead and recharge it i don't have the proper way to get here no letia teleport no regicide I just thought I would do it the normal way. Bam, 2,500 charges. How about we try to do some battles? Alone is doing Zolra. He would love if I got Cattle Stop or any of the Aram pieces. Now, initially, I was going to spend my whole cash stack on these death runes, but I realized you get deaths back from battles, so you should not really spend anything. However, sometimes you get unlucky, you don't get death runes. That's why I got a little fail safe, you know? This is such a weird gear. I don't have a kite shield. I have to wear a steel kite shield. I was going to get a granite shield, but it's 1 in 128 from trolls. Oh my god, I just read the chat. He got the first Zolra kill. <laughs> Told flags of Zolra skills. Yeah, we geared him. I gave him cash to go to Zolra. So Nick got a fire cape. He was the very first of our group. And he can access the Tockle shop where he can buy a lot of uncut gems. N not like any other store. You can buy 10 uncut sapphires. I'm going to assume that these uh, rubies are a little bit overstocked, so you cannot buy them. Is this overstocked or not? Is it 20 that you can buy? Well, since I'm doing also battles, I may give him uh, chaos runes, you know, but that's after like maybe 10 chests or something. This is awesome chests, you know why? Because I got cattle ball track, and that means I got a new collection lock slot. That means next time I will not get it anymore. Whenever I see it pop out, that means I got a battles item. Got call Go to Carol Slow, baby. That's that's the best item. Yeah, yeah, that is. That's oh, actually shit. We've for, got uh, the scar as well. Yeah, yeah, that's the oh, thing. Now, now we have now, right. skirt and and the top for uh, Zolra. Boys. 
that's why you're on that team. Surprised it didn't show in clan. I guess Barrow's chests don't count. Yeah, so anything you open doesn't count. So Wintertog crates, any Temporis things, Barrow's chest. Because you you have to actually receive the drop. Wait, leave the sl yeah the Slayer keys work. Right? Uh, that, uh, and uh, from Winter Todd, the pet does work though, because I've seen someone get. Yeah, dead. all pets work. All pets work. Even and so does like uh, Brim keys. So I've done ten battles chests so far, and my main concern is bolts, and I currently got sixty-seven. So it feels like I could do maybe twelve more, and I would be out of bolts, and I would have to go back to last man standing. I hate the minigame. game. I just say FK in the corners. I'm one of those guys. I can't PK. Plus, it's a US ping, you know. Thank you for watching this video.